Hi! So I'm actually doing a video blog, a vlog. Um, it's my very first time, so it's going to be awkward for the both of us. I, I'll, I'll tell you that right now. It's going to be awkward. <laughs> so, you know, whatever. Anyway, so welcome to Krista's first video blog. Good times. Um, okay, so first things first. So the biggest piece of news is that I'm uh, moving to LA in three weeks. Craziness. Um, yeah, so I was trying to see about moving back to the UK um, and moving to London, but it, I, it was really difficult trying to find somebody who was willing to even sponsor me for a work visa and I'm, I would not be able to legally work there. Uh, whether it's gigs or survival jobs or whatever so um, I kind of had to give up on that and focus on going back to LA and originally I was thinking November or January because of certain things that are going on but then yada 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 it, things happened and now it's um, mid-October so I'm thinking I'll be there about the 15th or 16th of October um, yeah, so I've got the ball rolling, got a lot of stuff going on, um, Andy and I are packing up the house, uh, um, anyway, so, yeah, so not only am I moving to LA, we, Andy and I are moving downtown this week, uh, so we're moving out of our townhouse, renting it out, moving downtown, and two weeks after that, I head out to LA, so, it's been fun, it's been crazy, and fun. Um, I know I've been complaining that I've been living in the same place for way too long, I think six years now, um, but having this many moves in the span of a couple months is crazy even by my standards. Um, so, but it is what it is, and it's great, it's going to be fantastic. Um, yes, it'll be difficult because my husband will be in Colorado and I'll be in California, um, but we've got some, we're, you know, working on different things and we're gonna make it work and we're also um, not the only ones doing that so <laughs> um, okay I have a list here's my list this is my list of stuff um, that I'm going to talk about in this blog and how much oh my god three and a half minutes I've been babbling yes I can babble non-stop for three and a half minutes oh my god oh one thing I'm gonna to need to remember is not to do this and stare at myself because that looks really awful for you guys so I'm trying to be really good and just stare at the camera oh doodles anyway okay so <laughs> okay what's next up on my list <gasps> meta romantic so I just finished a short another short with um, Elian Eliev you guys might remember that I did a short with him a couple years ago called the here between and um, that's been making the festival rounds and doing really well in fact it just went to Cannes this year so or con or cans as some of you people call it c-a-n-n-e-s con um, so yes, that con, the, the festival in France, it's, uh, it went to con. So that's friggin' amazing. Um, none of us were able to go over there because nobody could afford it, but next time we'll be there. Anyway, so I just finished up a short, another short with him, um, and it was just, um, it starred me and my friend Justin Frumkus. And uh, it was amazing, we, we both got to play like five different characters in different eras and um, which is a dream come true for for an actor to do it all in one you know one movie it was amazing um, so much fun a lot of work but it, it was a blast and I cannot wait to see it I'm not allowed to talk about a whole lot about it so um, I won't you've probably seen some of the pictures up on my Facebook page I need to get some on my website too but um, it was a blast and I, I can't wait to see it um, what else cheating Ooh. wild geese okay so wild geese and Colorado peaches I'm hungry <laughs> I can't help it so, <clears throat> I okay. So I've been talking about this um, short that I'm going to be writing, 
or that's I was going to be writing for uh, a long time now. <laughs> um, last November, I met a great guy at the Denver Film Fest um, and asked if he could he would mind being my director. So, and he said yes. So, he's going to be my director. And um, that was all well and good, except that I still had to actually sit down and write the darn thing. And I kept giving myself deadlines, and those deadlines would pass. And I'd give myself another deadline, and again, it would pass. Anyway, long story short, or try to anyway, um, I finally finished the first draft, got it to a couple of people who gave me some really great notes, um, got the second draft taken care of, and it was ten times better than the first. And um, I, and each time I, I did it, I got so in, so much more excited. Um, and then, so I, I sat down again with uh, my friend Mark on this past Saturday. He had a, just a couple different notes on um, simple formatting, so I made those minor changes, got the third draft taken care of, and now it comes to the really, really exciting part for me, which is getting the um, the actors attached. It's uh, there's one particular actor that I really, really am desperate to get, um, <clears throat> and Mark is helping me. He um, he has a one of his good friends is a friend of this particular actor that I want to get and has worked with him. So fingers crossed, that's the way we're going to go about doing it. There are other avenues, um, obviously, that we can do that, but we're going to start with that one really excited about it. Uh, the other actor is, um, well, he, he's fantastic as well. He's he's just as fabulous. His name is Joseph Mall, M-A-W-L-E. Um, he's not that well known, but he is, he's up and coming for sure. He's been in a lot of stuff. Um, in fact, he was just recently in Game of Thrones on HBO. He played Benjen, um, Ned Stark's brother. Um, anyway, he's a fantastic actor. Got fantastic look. I mean, just, I, just stare at him. He's got this really odd sort of look to him, and it's just, I mean, the camera loves him, and, and it's fabulous for this particular role. Um, anyway, so that's that. That's where we are, uh, and I might actually be turning it into a feature, which uh, I'm a little nervous about, because uh, I did just want it to be a short, but it might end up costing too much for a short, and if that's the case, then I will probably do it as a feature because we can get more funding for a feature than than for a short. But basically, it's set in 1691 Ireland. Um, most of the dialogue will be in Irish, and you know what? I figured, what the heck? <laughs> Why not make my very first short and foray into screenwriting um, as difficult as possible? Why not? It's me. Do you expect anything less? Um, so that's that. Oh goodness. Anyway, I'm really excited about it. I have there. It has such great potential, whether it's a short or a feature, um, and I will keep you guys updated on that. Um, yeah. What else? Um, oh my God! It's almost ten minutes already. Okay. Um, so I was also. God, this thing is so long. I'm so sorry. Nobody wants to hear me babble. This is why I don't do these things. Um, so I was also cast in an Irish film called Rebel City Rumble. It's a neo noir, um, a neo noir gangster flick. Um, potentially co-starring Quentin Tarantino, and my scenes would be with him. So it has it, not. It's not official yet, and it has not been announced. Um, but again, keep your fingers crossed that uh, that they'll be able to get him because that would be amazing. Um, we're filming probably in Arizona in February of 2012, so I'm really excited about that, and I've got a kick-ass scene. So yeah, it's gonna be awesome. Um, that's pretty much it. I mean, that's kind of enough, isn't it? Uh, <laughs> other than uh, you know, I'm, I'm getting things lined up for LA, roommates, housing, jobs, um, and also some networking events that I'm uh, already sticking on the calendar and um, meeting with already some people. Um, I won't 
say any more about that. Uh, <laughs> and I've finally, finally been working out and I have stuck with it for months, which is amazing for me. And um, yeah, I already see the results and I got, I was able to see the results for Meta Romantic, which is good because some of my costumes were teeny tiny. <laughs> and um, yeah, so rah, 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 mm, yeah, um, that's me in a nutshell these past few days. Crazy and babbly and um, peachy and oh my god, yes, I still make really bad puns and um, in, in, I'm in desperate need of a glass of wine, so hmm. So that's me. Wunderbar. All right. Ta-ta for now. Thanks for sticking around. <laughs> How do you sign off on these things? Everybody loves listening to people eat peaches, right? I thought so. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> oh, lordy.